Hey, what's going on, you guys? That work you guys to the channel. Sport Big Dog back with another one take review. Today, I got one for Cobra Kai season one. If you don't know what Cobra Kai season one is about, it's basically about Johnny Lawrence, aka used to be the bullet of my of my boy Daniel Sign in the first Karate Kid. Okay, now Danny Sign is a successful uh, car dealership owner and. Well, Johnny is is kind of like on bad luck. Like right? he 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 he's kind of like a deadbeat father. Um, he he's not really things aren't going good for him with work. Um, yeah, he's kind of like down in the dumps. So the only, and like he always seeing like the the billboards and stuff around with Dinosaur face on him. You know what I'm saying? So he it kind of like bothers him. So that whole thing that happened, that that, that tournament that happened. 30 something years ago, well, almost 30 years. Yeah, 30 something years ago, still bothering him to this day because that's, it seems like they took their lives in two different directions, which is crazy because that's just one tournament. Even though after that tournament, we see what his, uh, his sensei did to him and he broke his second place trophy and like, damn, it choked him to death, you know what I'm saying? So, but. It's the only thing he knows is karate. That's one of the few things that he has left in his world is his skill of karate. And so he embarks on re reopening, restarting back up Cobra Kai. And this will contain spoilers for season one. So unfortunately, if you have not seen it, uh, I apologize, but I have to get into some spoilers about this. Um, wow. This uh, put a lot. We got a new guy, Miguel. It, it's, it's so... It's really good how they did this. Because you have the, the nice kid, Miguel, who ends up joining the Cobra Kai. You have the bad kid, who was also uh, Johnny's son, Robbie, ends up like getting around uh, uh, Daniel Simon. Then you have Daniel Simon's daughter, Sam, who like has a crush. Well, what is they, Miguel? Miguel is going through this transition from like cool dude to, to gangster. Because this not. Ain't nobody watched this show and thought like Miguel was going to be the Miguel we got in episode 10. That boy turned all the way. I said, wait a minute. He said, I got to just say, I'm going to kill him dead. He didn't say that, but like he, he, he was thinking, he was like, hey! like, he had this look on his face where he really wanted, you look, you, he looked like he wanted to kiss your body, bro. I, I, I'm sorry. Then you got my boy, my, my, my boy Hawk, used to be called Lip. He turned the all way up. He popping pills before the thing. You know what I'm saying? Like the whole way this it plays out, I think it's really good. The one of the biggest issues I think is well, not even the biggest issue. It's just like the rivalry between Johnny and Daniel Sarah. It's just so like, dude, like y'all boys are beefing for what? Like I know people who be beefed up for like a long time. But like it's not over something like that. Like y'all fought and that was it. Like did like it's not like nothing else. And like he took your girl. Like 30 years later y'all still kinda like got this 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 ain't this, this um what's the word I'm looking for y'all? Type it in the comments real quick. Even though this video has already been uploaded. Tension between each other. It's, that's not the word I was looking for. It's definitely not the word I was looking for. This uh, animo animosity. Yep, I got it. Hey, it only took like 15 seconds just that I won't get back. So I won't get back either. But um, yeah, they, they got this like animosity still between each other. And I'm just like, dude, what is it? Like, what is, okay, I guess that's over. Like, what? what? It's just that. That's, that was the part that was weird to me. Also, the fact that like Johnny. It's still living in 1984. He doesn't know what nothing is. He still looks at the world in like this weird way. It, I get that, like that we, the way they portrayed him, but like just like dude, just act like this dude has been living under a rock for the past 30 years. Like what? Like, uh, that 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 seems very very weird to me. Like it's like he woke up in the future or some stuff. You know what I'm saying? That that was that was that was all right. Um, Robin situation. Is that man ever going back to school? 
Also, what was he? What did, did was he still staying at his house after like the whole like I? Because they showed us like his household situation and he's about to go stay with his dad until he seen him hugging Miguel, but it's like what? That was that was strange. That was strange. Also the high school stuff, I was just like with with a girl, the old boy Kyle. I'm happy they were Kyle, because Kyle Kyle was really playing fuck Kyle. Like that whole situation where he said she gave him some head. He said she gave him. Yeah, that that little thing. Everybody just laughing at her. I'm like, I, listen, bro. Listen, check this out, bro. This out. I I I don't know what school was like now, but I know it's worse. Okay, it it don't it did get better, and so I know what it was like when I was there, and the, if a situation like that would have happened. Eh. Nobody's like talking like that, bro. That, that, that didn't seem real. Like some of some of the characters seemed like cliche. Only person who really like seemed to like change was like Daniel. Not Daniel. Not, not Daniel. See, I, I I can't say it. I can't say the you know Daniel sign because I wasn't actually trying to talk about him. I, I meant to say Miguel because Miguel started off super cool, super chill, just like kind of nerdy dude. Trying to stick up pretty much like who Daniel Son used to be. And then like sticking you know, like I said, sticking up for people. And then as time goes, he, you know, became started to join Cobra Kai. He just started thugging. You know I mean? He was like I said, he ready by, by the time this season goes, he ready to catch your body. But it was weird. Like his transition happened pretty quick when his girl didn't text him back for a day. And he kind of like lost his cool. Granted, he did show up to the to, to their house unannounced and just seeing them there. Like he live, he taking his Cobra Kai stuff to the head really, really hard. And so when he just like kind of like snaps and gets a drink, and I'm like, dude, like this, this is pretty sudden. And like his whole character, his demeanor just changed completely. Now I'm like, okay, that's kind of the same thing with Hulk. Hulk just like, boom. One one day he could cheer, next day this man got a tattoo on his back and a hawk. Don't get me wrong. Hawk hawk my boy. Hawk my boy. Hawk full of full of drugs. Ain't no way you ain't finna tell me. Hawk then snort a line of cocaine before that tournament. If you if you do, you're lying. I'm telling you, that man was coked up. He was ready. His veins was popping, you know what I'm saying? He probably did some hair on too. You know what I mean? It's, it's crazy, you know what I'm saying? But it's my boy. He was he was out here. Um there's so many different things, like the, the friendship between Sam and the other chick, like the fact that Sam is really seems to be really good at karate, cause like she just kept flirting with it throughout. You knew by the end of the show, like okay, we're gonna see her do some of these. Of course, by I think season two, she actually joins and starts like training with uh, beside Johnny and uh, and thank you, Sam. So I liked it. I like Cobra Kai season one to five. Yeah, I, it took me a minute to get into it because I was like going back and forth. I was watching it and another show. I'm like, okay, whichever one of these shows hooked me in the first episode. And now one of them hooked me, so I had to go to episode two. And I think episode two or three of this is when I was just like, okay, I'm going to go ahead and finish this uh, season one today. Um, yeah, the, 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 the rivalry between, I'm looking at the picture now, the rivalry between Daniel Tyler and Johnny was just weird. Also, the ending was kind of weird to me. Well, we got uh, uh, the, his old sensei, uh, John Kreese, like coming out the shadows like a super villain. I got new Cobra Kai. They couldn't hold Cobra Kai down. I'm like, dude, what the hell? Like, what have you been doing for the past 34 years? You've been waiting 34 years for this dude to possibly start Cobra Kai back, and then you can make this amazing entrance. Bro, you, you you need to find a hobby. Shit. <laughs> but uh <laughs> y'all can expect season two review the season, review for season two tomorrow, cause I'm gonna go ahead and knock that out in like four hours. Y'all know how to do probably five hours. I think it's gonna take five hours. Either way, go I'm gonna knock that out for you guys to get that up. And I want I honestly wanna see what happens because I'm excited to see Sam training. Uh, Robbie was cool. I actually think I liked Miguel more. Robbie's character was cool, and then it kind of like, 
he kind of like lost his depth as 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 the season progressed. I want I would say uh, I do really like Sam's character. She just seemed like to be a, a super chill chill chick. You know what I'm saying? But like she just caught up in between a lot of stuff. But Johnny is definitely Johnny and Daniel Sam are definitely the two who who like carry this thing. And I uh, and probably Miguel too. Miguel definitely. Uh, um, it's got an interesting story, it's especially. I think the story is just interesting the, the way they the, they weaved everything together and how everybody's technically intertwined with the other. So uh, I appreciate that. R.I.P. that boy, Mr. Miyagi, man. R.I.P. Mr. Miyagi. But you gotta let me know if you thought about Cobra Kai season one down in the comments. Hit that like button, subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching the vid. Hope you guys are staying safe out there. Your boy, we catch up with y'all later. Peace.